Character, competence and citizenry have been identified as the building blocks for a successful Malay Muslim community in Singapore. Minister in charge of Muslim Affairs, Masagno Sul Kifli, also says there will be greater efforts to strengthen these areas. And included are plans to transform the religious sector and enhance support for education and skills. Nisha Rahim with more. Islamic religious teachers or asatizas hold significant responsibility in shaping the community's character and identity. And to allow more of them to do this, a three-year plan is in the works to professionalize the religious sector. The Islamic Religious Council of Singapore or MUIS will develop an asatiza workforce development plan aimed at building up the competencies of asatizas. To start off, MUIS will launch a career and competency framework in April to help teachers chart their career development. In the next three years, MUIS will develop more initiatives under the AWDP. This includes salary guidelines, a religious talent program to identify and develop future religious leaders, and more opportunities for skills upgrading. To ensure younger children are equipped with a strong foundation and have a good start in life, the Mandaki Mu'is Preschool Grant, or MMPG, will be open to families with children aged 6 or younger and a monthly per capita income of $650 and below. The pilot will benefit 100 preschoolers in the next three years. So with MMPG established in January this year, beneficiaries can see a quadrupling of their CDA savings. So for example, if you put just $1 a day in your child's CDA account, you will have $30 in a month. MMPG will double that amount to $60. And the government's CDA co-matching initiative will double the $60 to $120 a month. So the money can then be used to pay for your child's education and medical needs. Minister in charge of Muslim Affairs, Masa Guzu Kifli, also says he's happy to see the Malay Muslim community stepping forward in the nation's fight against COVID-19. Many Malay Muslims have been at the front line in the healthcare sector, home team, and even the passenger transport sector. I'm proud they are standing shoulder to shoulder with fellow Singaporeans in these fights. During this crisis, we see that citizenry is genuinely demonstrated. And the community has much more to contribute. A platform called Tripta Sama will engage the Malay Muslim community to participate in policy making. These engagements will be conducted at the 8M Cube towns this year.